Hi, my name is Boo Lam and I'm from the F5 Dev Central community team. I'm going to give you a quick overview of the current value proposition of F5. Before we do that, we're going to take a second to talk through how everything has come together at F5 over the years and how organizations use us today. In the early days, F5 solved problems around availability, performance, and security for monolithic applications. We did this with a full proxy platform called the Big IP. It came in a hardware appliance or a chassis form factor, or it could be purchased as a virtual appliance. A majority of the largest organizations around the world continue to use this technology today. They use it for load balancing, global server load balancing, and DNS, and then security features like single sign-on, VPN, web application firewall, and SSL traffic decryption. As the architecture of applications started to evolve towards microservices, we started to see some customers adapt to Big IP into those architectures. However, knowing that customers will want a more cloud-native solution, we acquired Nginx. Now, Nginx is a lightweight proxy that takes care of load balancing, API gateway, API security, and container ingress, and powers about 75% of the internet today. We then borrowed some of our best-in-breed web application firewall technology and made it available in the Nginx proxy so it could be deployed in a smaller form factor. This is a great option for the containerized world. It's consumed in a software or cloud-native format. And then there's the rise of cloud and SaaS solutions that are being delivered to the market today. So what we've done in that space is actually made a number of acquisitions and continued their development and eventually integrated them with our product sets. One of the bigger acquisitions was Defense.net, which was created by the pioneers of the DDoS industry. We later renamed this to F5 Silverline. This was a managed DDoS service and really a platform to start creating more services on. After DDoS, it was natural for F5 to meet customer demands and start offering a web application firewall service. The next acquisition was Shape Security. Shape is a leader in bot mitigation, credential stuffing, and manual fraud. So it's heavily used in financial verticals, retail, e-commerce, but we've also discovered use cases with utilities and other tech companies as well. Shape has the technology to allow you to identify what type of traffic is coming into your application, whether it's automated traffic or humans. If it's automated, is it the good or bad type of automation? And if it's human, are they acting normal or are they misbehaving with your application? There is immediate financial benefit to customers when they can prevent fraud loss or reduce transaction friction for the good users, which leads to increased sales. The next acquisition we made was a company called Volterra. Volterra was actually in stealth mode and we picked it up to become our cloud and SaaS platform moving forward. This platform dramatically increased our global network backbone and it can build multi-cloud networking connectivity. And it gave us a unique managed Kubernetes offering, which extends clusters to any cloud or any data center. As you can imagine, one of the first things we did was we brought over F5's market-leading WAF capabilities and started to offer that in a SaaS form factor. We also brought up DNS and global server load balancing capabilities, as well as bot and DDoS mitigation. Now, the next acquisition we made was a company called ThreatStack, which we now call Application Infrastructure Protection. And while we mostly address application security, this is where we're protecting the infrastructure the applications are running on through unique capabilities and observability. Wrapping all that together, we now call the entire platform the F5 Distributed Cloud. So if you take a step back and look at everything we now have in play, F5 addresses application delivery and security wherever the applications reside. This is a massive differentiator. If you consider who F5's competitors would be, they typically fall within the bucket of a SaaS solution or a microservices solution or a monolithic solution. And when you talk to them, they're gonna to want to convince you that their way to deliver their solution is the best and only way to do it. But when you talk to F5, we'll actually approach the opportunity consultatively. This way, we're not providing simply a product. F5 is truly providing a solution. I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, my name is Boo, and I'm from the F5 Dev Central community team. We run community.f5.com, where we publish technical articles and host message forums and user groups. And we publish videos across YouTube and all other social media platforms. So give us a follow if you haven't already, and I'll see you on the next one.